Hello and welcome to Minerik U, training in 60 seconds. When one or more motors are used on a machine, the types and level of performance required will quickly define the types of controller that can be used. Specific factors to define include the number of motors that will be used, the type of actions they'll perform, simple on-off, variable speed, or torque, or position. Variable speed is easier, variable torque more complex, and positioning is a science all its own. Does the controller want or need feedback to know if the motor performed as commanded, which might influence success of operations? Closed loop may not be necessary, but if needed, controllers must have appropriate inputs and logic to utilize the information. Do the actions of multiple motors need to be simultaneous, coordinated, or both? Simultaneous control is fairly easy, but true coordinated movement of motors is significantly more challenging. And what level of speed, accuracy, or repeatability are needed? As you can see, control can come in many levels, and not all controllers are equally capable. And not surprisingly, more capability typically means higher cost. That does it for this training minute. Thanks for watching.